What's up guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and finally the 4.3.1 untethered jailbreak has been released by the dev team for the iPhone 4, 3GS new and old boot ROM, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd gen devices, as well as the original iPad. Now we will be using Red Snow for either Windows or Mac in a fairly quick jailbreak that only takes a bit of time, although you may have some trouble here and there, but it is a fairly quick jailbreak. You will need two things on your desktop. You'll need Red Snow, of course, and your 4.3.1 IPSW firmware file for your device. All links can be found in the description, where a link will take you to my site with an in-depth guide and all the links there. Of course, make sure your device is plugged in, and for those of you wondering, this will work on a tethered jailbreak, so if you're on 4.3.1 currently tethered, all you'll need to do is follow my instructions and run Red Snow over the tethered jailbreak, and you will become untethered. If you've got a clean slate on 4.3.1, then you're ready to begin, and if you're on an older firmware, you will need to update to 4.3.1 for this jailbreak to work. Okay, so enough said, let's get started. Now make sure these two files are on your desktop and right click Redstone and run as administrator. Browse for your official 4.3.1 firmware and wait for it to process for a bit. Here since I have a 3GS it's asking me if I have a new or old boot ROM in order for it to tell whether I can have custom boot logos or not. I'm going to click yes because I know I have a new boot ROM. Of course you won't be asked this on an iPhone 4 or an iPod or an iPad. So here it'll patch the kernel for a bit and once it's done we get a little bit of options all I'm gonna do is install Cydia because I just want to jailbreak now if you have an iPhone 3GS that does not have the 6.15.00 baseband and you want to get that baseband in order to unlock you'll wanna click this this is not to unlock the iPhone 4 only the 3GS okay so all I'm gonna do is install Cydia because I just want to jailbreak and click next now it'll ask us to turn our iPhone 3GS off or our device. And okay. So now we will be putting it into DFU mode. And I'm going to click next. I'm going to hold down the power button for 2, 1, together with the home button for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let go of the power button. And I'm going to keep holding the home button until Red Snow recognizes my iPhone. okay so it's exploiting with lime rain and we're almost done here now it's gonna take a bit for our 3GS to be jailbroken and you'll be able to tell it'll have that icon like that so I'll be right back after it's done alright my iPhone has booted up after the jailbreak and now we should see Cydia on our springboard open it up and you are now untethered and jailbroken on 4.3.1 so enjoy your jailbreak guys, and for those of you that are waiting to preserve your baseband onto 4.3.1, I'll have a video up in no time of Pwnage Tool, I'll put a link somewhere up here. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and again, enjoy the jailbreak guys.